Folks, hope you had a great weekend. Uh, definitely a little uptick in our tropical activity over the last couple of days. We have Tropical Depression 5, which of course formed back on Saturday morning. That has now moved past Bermuda. And it's pretty much just moving out into the North Atlantic shipping lane. Still a potential there that we get a named storm, but I don't see a whole lot of strengthening with this as it continues to race off to the north and east. So no concerns with that. Closer to home, you see that area in the north northern gulf kind of centered near pensacola back towards biloxi there's a weak area of low pressure just trying to spin up there you can kind of just tell the broad cyclonic flow in the atmosphere you see the showers and storms kind of pulling back to the west uh, across alabama and mississippi that's a sign that we're trying to get something to spin up uh, no concerns for this in the short term i really don't think think we'll see this develop at all but it's certainly going to help produce some extra shower and storm coverage as it moves across north florida and eventually into Georgia over the next 24 to 36 hours or so. So another day tomorrow with widespread scattered showers and thunderstorms developing across uh, the state of Florida. Now, once this eventually pushes into the Atlantic and kind of rides up the coast of the Carolinas into the mid-Atlantic states, there's a bit of a better environment. We could certainly see something weak spin up, but still just too much land interaction as of right now for this to turn anything into anything consequential. Still going to provide a, a good dose of rain for spots near the coastline from Georgia all the way up through uh, Delaware and perhaps as far north as New Jersey. So we'll be watching that as we go throughout this week. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. We'll talk again in a couple of days.